All right, I wanted to write a review or just uh, share with you guys a quick video on the Lyson magnetic car holder. So before I bought this, uh, I went on, I went on the reviews and I wasn't really sure if the suction would work for what I wanted it, which was to mount this tablet on on front of my dashboard. You know, um, I I have several uses for having something like this in my car, uh, sharing media with. Uh, anyone who gets in the vehicle with me uh, also for taking trips or if you ever have to navigate um, and don't want to be having a switch between your phone for phone calls and your navigation and that sort of thing um, if you have the means of getting a, a, a tablet or something like that that you like to just prop on your dashboard uh, this um, magnetic case uh, seems to do the trick now I only bought one because I was I wasn't sure if, one if it was gonna work for what I needed it, um, and now as you can see, this is a Galaxy Tab S7. Um, it weighs about a, a pound, uh, 1.1 pounds. After uh, I did the, the conversion of of the, uh, I think it's 500 and something grams, but it equals to 1.1 uh, uh, pounds, and it's it's pretty stable as far as the the magnet goes. Um, it, I mean it it holds. I'm. I'm flicking it obviously if you if you're familiar with uh, uh other magnet holders uh you know if you slide it down it's gonna lose its grip but it it holds pretty well um if you know how to position it my only i'm thinking i'm gonna get a second one because as you can see if um i'm not sure if you can see through this video but as you touch a little bit it does give it a wiggle mm -hmm. because i have the magnet centered in the back and i think that if i uh, I, ha I have a nissan altima this is a 2007 model but as you can see, I have it centered in the middle. I'm sure that if I was able to put one on each side, um, it would fasten it all, uh, so much better to eliminate the wiggle. And uh, another reason why I only got one is because I thought I wanted it to 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 swivel. I thought that that's something that I wanted for 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 this magnet. But now that I see it actually uh, put placed here in, in my car. Um, I don't really need the swivel maybe the up and down to eliminate glare as you drive as you can see you do get a little glare uh, but there's the fact that it swivels you can kind of adjust it to your preference to eliminate that uh, I could have even put the magnet uh, maybe more towards the top and have it sit down here or even higher and that would have you know been, gave it the ability to tilt uh, a little actually now that I see it yeah let me see if I can get it to do it. Yeah, this is where a second magnet would come in handy because you can you can still have the up and down uh, swivel, but maybe not left to right if you have two magnets because they would kind of uh, I think they would conflict with each other if you try to move it left and down, uh, left to right, or but up and down should be just fine um, to eliminate glare. But now that I have it mounted on here, I mean it looks pretty darn sharp. Here, let me see if I can move it over a little bit once you oh I also have a Bluetooth controller an Android Bluetooth controller that works amazing with this tablet um, if uh, you like to there's certain apps that don't work very well with a Bluetooth controller or remote um, I also have um, a Bluetooth uh, mouse. I know I'm kind of a dork when it comes to these things, but uh, a Bluetooth mouse works well too. I don't have it set up right now um, to this. Actually, let's give it a shot. I have a little time. Let's.